done to privately owned pine plantations around the National Forest, all of which are planted with a lot of them because it grows faster. And in fair weather, you get a bigger tree faster, but the first time you have an ice storm, you've got a mess. So, I, so you know, nature you to give us short lived times. So that's what we need to be planning up here in the not other ones. But they're hard to find. Try to find them. If you buy one, I'd like to hear from I'm sorry, Doug, what? Flash, just pointing out that the main timbers in this building. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fine. They, they, the timbers in this building were logged from up around Beaver Lake or Hop State Park now and hauled down here with ox carts and shortly pine timbers. And when they redid this building, those big beams that are, that are holding up this building were still good enough to stay in the building. They did replace some, and they did modifications, but that was hard, slow growing, tight grain, high quality lumber when it was cut in 1870, and it's still really good now. But we 
we've got to stop allowing cats to walk freely, whether they're a cat colony or whatever. Well, I don't like that. Joe, a word about coyotes. A gaming fish commissioner has a gaming fish commissioner, according to the newspaper story on the weekend, is proposing that they make coyote hunting legal year round in the in the whole state. Would this uh, benefit ground nesting quail and so forth? Is it, is it really would it really help to have them hunting coyotes out there all year? I don't know. I don't think I'm the first to answer that question. Because I have really mixed feelings about all of that. The coyotes are hunted year round as it is. It's just, it's, you know, most of it's barbecue. And uh, so, do you have any thoughts about the. Well, all I can say is they weren't here to begin with. I agree. I lived in Northwest Arkansas on the Bay Hill, and the first one came into the state. Up to then, so they were moving east, and they're now in Central Park in New York City. Then they're in Central Park. All right, so let's give a final round of applause for a second. 